Hey guys, it's Larry Greenberg, and today we're taking a look at the Tech 21 Evo Mesh case for the iPhone 6 Plus. This case comes in five colors and it sells for $34.95. Now I've had my eye on this case for a while, yet it has been pretty much unavailable in white for the 6 Plus. I've seen a few of them floating around, but they have not been any, in any stores. They weren't on Amazon. They finally showed up on apple.com the other day, so I went ahead and ordered one up, and it came the very next day, which is pretty cool. $34.95 plus a little shipping, and I got my case. So here it is. Inside the packaging is nothing other than the case itself. And like I said, this is the hard to find, but no longer, white version of the Evo Mesh. And basically what this case is, is a kind of TPU style shell with um, a good amount of protection and it's in that kind of white with dimpled pattern that I think is really unique. So you can see it here, it kind of has that frosted look on the back, which I really like. And uh, let's pop my 6 Plus in here. So you just start with the top, really doesn't matter. I usually start with the button side first and then kind of click the button or the bottom part into place. Now it's a tight fit. Um, it doesn't look like it when you put it in there, but you know, this case doesn't feel loose. The only kind of issue, like a sagging issue is down at the bottom, but it's minor and I don't think it's anything I'd worry about. The sides don't flex or anything like that. Basically, I think this is a spot on fit. Whether it gets like looser over time, that'll be something I'll have to test out. But for right now, the case fits nice and snug, which I really like. Now, there is a ever so small amount of lay on the table protection from this case. That lip does come up just a bit higher than the screen. I do have a tempered glass screen protector on, which of course raises the screen up a little bit more, but you still get some when you put it screen side down. The buttons themselves are uh, built into the case, they're covering the buttons on the phone. They give a really nice amount of tactile feedback when you press on them, and I have no issues getting to that mute switch. I can get to it just fine. The cutout is spot on perfect. On the bottom, you've got three individual cutouts for the speaker, the lightning port, the headset jack, and mic. And um, I'm happy to report that all of the third-party accessories I've tried have fit in all of these ports just fine. On the back, you kind of have a rectangular cutout or almost teardrop shaped for the camera, the secondary mic and flash, and you can see it's outlined in black. And then as I mentioned, you've got this matte back with dimples all over it, and you still get to see and enjoy the Apple logo and all the Apple goodness on the back of your phone as well. This case is surprisingly slim, yet very protective. You know Tech 21 has um, is known for their protection. Uh, if I pull the package, Back in, it's all over, you know, protection, impact protection. Uh, they talk about their material that is specially formulated to absorb and dissipate shock away from your device should you drop it. So I'm not one, knock on wood, uh, that drops my phone, but I'm happy to know that this, you know, what I call a slim case might just save the life of my phone should I happen to do so uh, because of all the protection. So the Tech 21 Evo Mesh is now available on apple.com in all five colors for $34.95 and you can learn more about it via the link I'll have in the video description. I'll also have a link down there to more coverage of this case over on runaroundtech.com. As always, if you have any questions about this or anything else, drop me a line down below. Otherwise, have a great day.